Hi guys, Charlie here. And yeah, I'm on Kibble Beach in Broome. It's not a surprise anymore. <laughs> um, I'd like to talk to you about the video I've recorded um, called You Have Power Over Your Life. Because I've, I've rewatched it and um, I imagine being one of you and watching it and saying, oh, okay, right. So I've got power of, over my life, I can change my life, I can maybe even change the world, I can follow my dreams, I can live the life I want. Okay, cool, thank you for telling me that, but now, what do I do? <laughs> Where do I start? <laughs> what do I start with? Because everything around me is dark and I don't know what to do. Um, yeah, so... Um, I imagine you can be asking yourself, okay, yeah, cool, thank you, but, and now? Um, so, what I can tell you, and maybe share with you, that can, I hope, help you, is... Again, with my own experience, how did I start? Well. I knew I wasn't feeling good at all. I knew uh, I needed to change something. I didn't know what. I didn't know what to do. I didn't know, yeah, what would happen. But so I asked myself, and I started analyzing my own life and what I like in it. That match and what I didn't like in it and there was a big list um, and I realized that the first thing is I didn't like the place I was living in and that was a big a big thing for me because I grew up in well I am Belgian I'm from Belgium and um, I moved many times to France and back in Belgium and back to France again. Um, and I didn't have the choice. I needed to follow what my mom uh, chose to do. I was a child, so I was following. Um, and uh, well, growing up, I felt like I didn't really have any roots. Even if I'm from Belgium, I don't feel Belgian and I grew up in France and I don't feel like I'm French either <laughs> so what am I and I don't feel good in those countries any of them no none of them so wow it's like I have the choice in between two countries but no none of them <laughs> uh, is good for me or makes me happy or whatever and I felt like I needed to find my own place, maybe, and yeah, find where a place where I could find, I could feel in peace and feel right with myself. So that was my first, the first thing I analyzed about my life, and and so that was maybe something to follow and to do. But where to go? Oh. Um, I heard, I have a friend who uh, told me that his dream was to come to Australia. And as I told you, I don't know, I didn't know many things about Australia. I always wanted to come because I was curious about it, but I didn't know many things. And then I thought, yeah, okay, so that's maybe it, that's maybe a sign or something. And um, maybe that's what I should do. All right, let's do it. How do I do that? I don't have any money. I don't know where I'm going. I don't know anything about the country or anything. All right. So I started watching every videos I could find about Australia, talking about Australia, um, on YouTube, on anywhere. Um, I followed blogs talking about Australia, blogs, uh, travelers blogs, backpackers blogs, um, 
and I've watched everyday videos of the travel and what they were living and I was just like wow amazing life can be like that you know I was in my couch and it was dark and raining outside and cold and uh, I was alone and feeling bad and, and I was watching what people could live and feel their freedom and feel their happiness and yeah I start to to be excited about it and and that was it I thought that that was my solution um, so I think maybe if you don't know what to start with just ask yourself analyze your, your life analyze what is around you that is okay or not good at all or that what you you can't yeah that you really hate about your life for the moment and start with that step by step just take one thing so I took my environment I started with that and that's what I changed and that's why I started traveling and that's what changed all my life um, maybe for you it can be your relationships or your your health or anything and actually when you start with something it will affect the other aspects of your life so it will work if you start working on one thing and focusing on one thing and really put all your, your energy in it it will help you in every aspect so for example I decided I needed to live live and live actually um, and I was so deep down I was so I was feeling so bad that I knew that if I told anyone about my plan or what I was working on I wouldn't be able to receive any negative energy from anyone I, um, I wasn't strong enough for that so I needed to put a distance in between my relationships family, friends and myself I started working on one thing, the environment, to change that and on my mind, on my thoughts because when I started watching all those videos of Australia I started to change my thoughts I started to dream, I started to hope in something different and I started to, yeah, to feel more alive and feel like I can do something because I can tell you that you have power over your life but if you don't do anything about it or I mean you need to you need to know it for yourself and that's by starting with your mind too so just think about that check what's around you analyze your life Check what you can change or not and work on that in any aspect of your life and this will slowly step by step it won't your life won't change from one day to another so you have to work hard for it sorry to say that maybe that's not what you want to hear but if you want to it will happen and that I can tell you so I really wish this can help um, don't hesitate just do it just step by step don't stress about uh, everything because I know that when you when you're in negative around surrounded by negative energies you just see that but you have to find a light a solution something that you can work on and grow that line and slowly get out of there it's time 
Thanks for watching, guys.